Now this underground passage, it does exactly what you would think it would do. You, you're eventually going to go out somewhere else. But there is also a uh, second floor to this, a second... Yeah, I guess you could call it a floor here, even in a dungeon. I was about to say like a second level, but same thing. And it does have the glowy chest here as well, so you definitely want to find that before you make it all the way through. I f looks like I found another dead end, uh, but I did find another ring. Hopefully it's better than what I got. There are crossbows in this game too. You, I, th I think I've gone over that. You need bolts for them instead of the arrows. Uh, but to be honest, yeah, I have a melee character. I'm going to keep him melee until like there's some really awesome bow or crossbow that I come across. But the chances of that are pretty low. You know, I like my scepters. I like them good. They give me a bonus to stats. Which is always nice. Cracked Hunter's Bow. That is what uh, Mahala has as a Hunter's Bow. But it's cracked, so I don't care. Superior Scimitar, I still don't care. I got Scepters now. Uh, once, once I get an item like that, the Scepter, I pretty much don't care what else you throw at me unless it's another Scepter. Because a lot of this is going to be uh, what my skills are instead of what the damage I'm doing is. That's really gonna be where I where I improve the most is is in skills instead of damage output. Especially when I got Might on and she's doing a lot of damage for me. Yeah, traps th they don't nearly do as much damage as they did in the last game, which is a lot better if you ask me. You know, decisions to open up a chest or not shouldn't be a life or death decision. Come on, get oh Thank you. Now we've got to be coming across at least like something, either the exit or the way to the next floor. This is a skeleton you can move. Yeah, the dead rogues you can always move. Oh, amulet! Yes. Yes, I do know all the sounds in the game. Uh, the well, it uh, the well will uh, cure some of your health and some of your mana. So. Keep that in mind. Why my mana is constantly showing like that, I don't really know. But I, I don't remember if it did that all the time, or if this is maybe a glitch that I'm having, but there it is, in case you wanted to know exactly how many mana points I have. I don't even need the light stuff anymore. Crude targe, targes! We'll, yeah, we'll go over that in a second. Targes can be awesome. This one's probably going to suck, but I want you to uh, you know, at least look at it because I'm a paladin and it's important. Uh, as a paladin, you can equip these targes. Uh, paladin only. Uh, it, it has crap defense, pretty much. Same as a, as a buckler and all that kind of stuff, but it gives plus resistance to everything. So it might be worth checking out. I'm a, in fact, I'm going to put it there um, on my second one. It's not as good as my first one, though. Oh! Let's identify and equip that amulet. Uh, plus one to light radius, plus ten to max stamina, plus ten to attack rating. Awesome. Light radius is pretty much uh, how far away you can see. Uh, it's okay. I, I really don't care that much about it. But it's there. So anytime it's like minus to... to to light radius, that's not a big penalty to me. There are penalties on some of these, uh, some of these items. Yeah, nothing really. We got to be getting close to something, you know. I know this place is supposed to be huge, but seriously, give me something. Die, misshapen. They have a ranged attack, but yeah, they're they're still not that strong at all. Okay, hopefully this place is like a circle and I don't have to backtrack. No matter, like, either way. If it's the exit, I want to backtrack until I find the, the second level. Oh, it's not nearly as big as the circle I was hoping. This leads to the dark wood, so that's the exit. Let's go ahead and use one of the stamina potions. And keep running. 
We need to find the second level. I know there is one. So we need to find it so I can get the loot out of there. I'm very OCD like that. Plus, you know, like I said, loot is pretty much half of this game. It's finding the good stuff. You know, uh, yeah, you can do the quest, you can kill the enemies. But really, man, the loot. Let's see, nothing here. There's, there's the way that I didn't go yet. Up this way. So let's go there. We're gonna find something. Give me something. Hurry, my stamina approaching skull. Yes, my skin hardens thanks to thanks to the armor shrine. Like I said most of these are pretty self-explanatory. I did pass a few refilling shrines without really explaining what they were. They refill both uh, your your HP, your health, and your mana. Is it called? It's called life. Sorry. <laughs> I know I call it health and HP because that's what I'm used to, but technically it's life in this game. Is there anything else here? Sometimes, uh, behind the... behind the ways, uh, to the next level, there'll be a lot of gold or even a chest there. Really? Have I really been writing that much? Alright. There's the chest. You can already see it. Let's go get it eventually. Oh yeah, I knew there was going to be another one of you. Die, shaman! Alright, let's go this way. Oh, shit. We got an extra fast one. And we got black... I didn't even get the full name. Spine kill! Whoa, 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 whoa. That was close. I didn't see how fast my, my HP was going down. But she killed him! Awesome! Let's grab those leather gloves. Now you notice that I did get um, two green items, but they're different. This is the Arctic Furs uh, from the Arctic Gear collection, and this is the Infernal Cranium from the Infernal Tools collection. It, like I said, it's so incredibly rare just to find green stuff. I don't know how much level grinding and, and reloading old save well not old saves, but reloading and going back and trying to find stuff in order to complete a collection that would drive me nuts I don't know they didn't even need to bother putting it in single player I don't know anybody that's ever finished a set in multiplayer let alone in single player it, that would be ridiculous you know and I assume that in multiplayer you gotta go into a chat to find somebody that has something that you're looking for I never even keep this stuff Really, I'm overburdened already. All right, be right back. Uh, one more quick thing about the uh, the auras. You can only have one at a time. So even though I have all these auras, these are all auras: resist cold, resist fire, uh, defiance, prayer, might. They're all auras. Uh, you can only have one equipped at a time. So if you want to resist fire, you gotta equip it like that. Uh, so you know, I'm I'm keeping might. Uh, that that's but that's how auras work. I got Death's hands leather gloves. So now that's three different collections that we've already got. These are better than the ones I had, even though they have lower defense. Poison resist and poison length reduced by seventy five percent. That poison length one especially is is very good. Now the fulminating potions, those sell for quite a bit, so I'm gonna grab those. Everything else I don't need. Let's keep going. We're gonna take on all these shamans. This fallen dagger. Nice shot. Oh damn, that's a lot of covers. So many covers were scary at all. Damn. Just like one shot and I'm all die. And then, of course, uh, I, I do have quite a good chance to hit. Does it show chance to hit? It does. 95% chance to hit. Like I said, attack rating... We'll get to a point to where it's pretty much useless, but there's going to be so much plus to attack rating that it's just going to be ridiculous. Now, I do remember there was one spot near the beginning of, of the passage that I did not go. You can kind of see it there up here. So let's make a, a quick 
check over here just to make sure there's no specials or, or chests. Yeah, just one of you. Okay. Now I, I know I'm going to need to use a stamina potion. Let's go to the dark wood, which is on the other side. We need to just make... Uh, just go as fast as you can, man. I believe in you, Balascuba. Run. Run. But yeah, he does eventually get tired. Eventually. It takes quite a while, though. I know, I, I probably couldn't run this fast with all that armor. Especially, like, look how he's holding the scepter. He's got to keep it up like that and the shield's up. That's a long way to run. That's why I gave him crack. I mean, stamina potions. It's definitely not skooma. Well, let's go through here to the dark wood. Like I said. And we've emerged on the other side. Now, I remember there were, there's probably a couple things I need to get done here. But first off, let's go into this building. Buildings are always good for nothing. Come on. Nothing, really? And we found another carver camp. Now we are st gonna start seeing carver shamans. We weren't seeing those before, but they are definitely gonna start showing up now that we've made it through the passage. I saw an archer over here. Damn skeleton archers! Die. Okay, I picked something up. I think it was a po it's fulminating potion. That's the bad thing. Sometimes you. You click on things you did not want to pick up. You do have to click on all the gold in this game. I do know that in Diablo 3, that does not happen. In fact, uh, y you just run across it and you pick it up. I know that because I, I, I played a little bit of it. It's fun. Uh, Diablo 3 is fun. Hurry up and release it once I'm done with this. Let me finish this first, Blizzard. I, I totally know they listen to me. I no longer fear fire. Skull cap is crap. Preserved head. The last one that I had was crap and didn't sell, but I'm going to hold on to it because it has plus three to raise skeleton. The last one I had for, sold for like a hundred and something. I was very disappointed. Was, yeah, plus three to something is, is awesome, and I'm, I'm going to hold on to it just because of that. Otherwise, I probably would have dropped it if it was just the plus one. Always got to keep... A oh, champions! Okay, champions. Um, we, haven't, we haven't seen any champions yet. There's, they always come in at least two. Uh, there's champions. Um, there's, there's berserkers. That was what we took on there. They drop um, either a lot of gold or an item. And then on top of that, uh, two potions all the time. So y y you want to find those as well, and, and kill them. Spike Fiend! It's been a while since we've seen Quill Rat. Yeah, those guys, they're annoying, and we'll be seeing a few of them. Damn, where is the upper part of this? I might actually have to use a potion. Really Buckley, let's use one. Yeah, we picked up a minor one somewhere along the way. Let's use that. Won't heal me up all the way anymore. But I wasn't really, you know, needing a full heal yet. Yeah, ranged enemies against a melee guy, it gets annoying. Luckily, I got a ranged person on my side. Go, mercenary. Uh, I d yeah, I do pick up all the keys. They, s they go in stacks of 12, but then as soon as I have uh, more than 12, I sell anything over it. I'm just trying to keep the one stack. How did I not hit him so many times? Die. Uh, there's another one. Can you start shooting? That'd be appreciated. Mahala, you're not holding up your end of the bargain. I picked up arrows that I didn't need. Hurry up and kill these guys, man. Probably didn't help that I called her a man. But that's not the point. Pick up the... Yeah, automatically... Yeah, when I have this open, it doesn't go in there. I forgot that. Uh, this is the corner. Okay. There's got to be another one around here somewhere. Yeah, there's a few more over here. Oh, damn. How that 
spear fit into that small little guy? How the hell did it fit? Whatever. It looks like we've already found the exit. This moves on to... Black Marsh, yeah. So we're going to stick in the dark wood for a little bit here. I do believe there is a waypoint in the dark wood. I'm kind of hoping on it. Because, yeah, uh, use that when I did not need to. Yeah, you know, peels everything. Oh, skeleton notch hiding in the trees. They can't hide the trees, man. I'll grab that. Well, is this ten? Still two away from using my skills. Points. Not using my skills, just the points. Oh, uh, I need Let's look at the ring. Oh, that's like the worst one that you can get. Holy crap. But, um, I'm, I'm still going to try to pick up stuff, even if it's crap. Because even bad rings sell for about, you know, 800. So, I'm going to keep them. Oh, the Tree of Inifis. Oh, it's always guarded by a champion brute, which is tree here, tree head, wood fist. And since I stumbled on his name, I didn't get to see his stats. I'm out of room. Uh, no, I'm not. Is it Spike Club? I'm not out of room. I don't know what you're talking about. Go up to the tree. It drops a scroll. Can I pick that up? I can't carry anymore. I cannot pick that up. No, I. Come on, you can handle it. If I drop the keys, I can pick it up. It takes up four spots. Uh, can I look at it? Take, take it to a car. Okay. Huh. I don't know what that is with the pentagram in the middle and all that kind of stuff. <coughs> die, die. Cracked hard leather armor. Not gonna be worth it. Still looking for the the waypoint. That's pretty much going to be my stopping point as soon as we find it. That's why I'm kind of counting on one to be here. But there are a ton of covers here. Damn, look at all those covers. I don't see a shaman anywhere. I think that at this point they still come in groups without shamans. Damn you, preserved head. Oh! Hella leveled up. There's, there you are. Did not see you earlier. Let's try to find s something. Something good. Cracked light crossbow. Okay, I found a hidden stash there. Jeez, I didn't even, wasn't even looking for anything. Scroll of identify. Oh. I am overboard. Can't even. All right, I'm gonna go back to town. Akara, you have something to say. Ah, oh, very good. I have translated the runes on this scroll. You must find the cairn stones and touch them in the order that I have written. So yeah, we need to go back to the cairn stones, but uh, we'll probably take care of that some other time. I do need to clear up inventory, though. All right, while I was in town, I did identify that yellow hunter's bow that we grabbed, and I definitely put that onto Mahal Mahala. I will remember that one of these times. It's like Mahalo, but Mahala. Uh, so now that she has more damage, um, plus attack range, so she's going to hit more often. I think she always hits, though. I don't think it ever misses. Uh, more damage to undead, more damage to undead, uh, plus lightning damage, plus cold damage, and she resists lightning. She does need that as well. Let's pick up that preserved head because the other one I got sold for quite a bit. Uh, let's look at our quest log. Go to the Cairn Stones in the Stony Field. Touch the stones in the order found on the scroll of Inifis. Enter the portal to Tristram, but beware the danger that lies ahead. We will go to Tristram. You can go to Tristram in this game. In fact, you need to. Uh, the Countess, I believe, is an optional quest, but this one, going back to Tristram, I believe that is mandatory in order to keep the story going. But I highly, I would highly suggest it even if it wasn't, because the reward for that one 
probably better than any other reward for any other quest in the game. I'll be honest, it's ridiculous how awesome that one is. Let's tr go this way and try to find me a waypoint. I swear there's one here. I swear. Please don't tell me I'm wrong and I have to go... Get over here and die. And I have to go back. Okay. I feel more skillful. So now, yeah, skill level is now four on might instead of just one. So that's awesome. I mean, it's a free upgrade. <laughs> What's there to complain about? There is the waypoint. And that looks like it is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Diablo 2. I have been Baller Scuba. I've been joined as always by Baller Scuba and Mahala. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.